Hello guys, welcome back to Craftonomical SMP Feel the Beast Revelations. How are you guys doing today? I am doing pretty fantastic. And today, guys, we are going to replace what is in my hand right here with the staff of awesomeness or power or draconic everything. But guys, I did a little bit of work here off camera, uh, sidetracking. So we're gonna see about putting maybe another one, a crafting system here, that way we can do them two at a time. Um, but I just went ahead here and um, obviously I've, I've already started to infuse some of these as you can see this is infused let me actually go take you up to our infusion chamber area uh, if we go on back here like so if we look over here oh uh, i do have a machine infuser and it's actually finished with one right now i think that's our last one but i got a whole bunch of uh, dimensional shards here they're just feeding into our machine infuser and then it's just uh infusing all of them so i guess now they can transmit 30,000 RF per tick instead of just 20,000. So I've got, I think, three um, receiving in the, um, in our, at our Nether Star generators. Um, so it's, it's putting stupid power into these guys, which is what exactly we need. Um, I don't know if that actually made sense, those logic words. Um, but today, guys, we're going to start off by making one of these dislocators. Um, it allows you to, or it's an advanced dislocator. It allows you to set multiple points so you can just teleport to wherever you want. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and do that. I've got all the materials here. So one, two, three, gotta make it look fancy schmancy even though it doesn't need to be. Uh, and then we need a wyvern core over there. As you can see, I've got a bunch of these crafted up because we're gonna need them when we craft the shard or the wand of power, whatever it's called. Um, and then we just need four draconium. That's easy. And then we're gonna go Hold up, did I? Yeah, that's better. Jeez, not even centered. All right, so as you can see, this is crafting pretty fast. I've got uh, basically the same setup. I'll show you guys back here. Um, so we've just got a advanced power cell. These ones do transmit more power, going into resonant flux ducts, and they're going into the back. So it's pretty cool, and I love this animation every time I watch it. It's just so cool, guys. It's like a ritual. So it would be really cool if you could hear when that went off. So it's like, boom. So let's go right here. If we right shift, right click, we're going to add new. This will be home base. And we can commit. Yep, okay, it's perfect. So that worked. Let's grab some ender pearls here so we can add some fuel. I will show you its awesome features. Uh, okay, let's shift click. All right. So if we go, say, way out here to our old base, and we want to set, um, say, our, uh, we'll call this the remote base, right? So we'll add this one. Remote base. Then we'll commit it. We'll lock both of these down so we can't unbreak them. So then we go home, boom, right? And then we can head on back. So pretty cool. Now I can just teleport here and back whenever I so please. All right, guys. So I think we've got everything here to make our um, staff of power. Let's see here. So let's put... <clears throat> actually, no. We need to have him here, this guy here. And then I believe it's just two ingots over on this side. No, okay, so what is it? Let's see where to go. Staff of power. Oh, we got to infuse our sword and a draconic shovel. Well, that changes things. So let's go ahead and make the shovel, which should be that recipe there. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and pull the enchants off of the sword, guys, because I really do like these enchants. And we're going to put these on the new um, staff of power. All right, guys, I think we got everything we need to make up our staff of power. So I've taken the enchants off of this and we've crafted up another core. So let's see here. And I've also upgraded these to the max tier. So we're just gonna put these both on the bottom here. Um, but let's look. See, so we need, there we go. Need the core on one side. Okay. And then I believe one, two, three, four, five. Perfect, so we do have enough. Okay. So let's throw these here like so. And two, three, four, five. Perfect. 
Okay, how much RF does this take? Because how long is this going to take us to do... Oh, 100... Wow, that'll take... That'll be quick. Bom, bom, bom. Let's go. So our... This doesn't do the sh the axe, though. That's kind of lame. Wish it did. Oh, okay. Let's get a good screenshot of this. Boom. That'll be the thumbnail. Okay. Would you just look at that, eh? 48 million RF. So I'm going to let this charge up, guys, and then we're going to go have some fun with it. All right. We got it all charged up. Now let's go have some fun. What does it look like? Oh, my gosh. It's ginormous. See, we, we got to get another screenshot. This is so much power. That might be a good thumbnail as well. Anyway, well, well, we got some choices. Not a bad thing. Okay. So let's go. There we go. We're flying again. Oh, what am I doing? Let me just go back. Boom. We teleported from like right there. Oh, we're still flying too. That's cool. Okay. Oh, we're okay. We're okay. All right. Oh, so it's got Instamine on it, eh? That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Now, let's see here. What are the attack radius? Um, dig speed, multiplier, dig depth. That is crazy. Just digs five back instantly. How about down? Yep, goes straight down too. That's cool. All right, let's see here. Uh, we'll, we'll take that back down. We'll take that back down. Dig speed multiplier. Okay, by a thousand. That's on. Hmm. Hmm. This stuff of power is quite a Oop, missed. Oop, missed. Get me out the hole. Thank you. Okay. This is cool, guys. Let's go. Let's head on back to home base. All right, now let's see here. We don't need to make. Oh, wait, hold up. Oh, look at that. We got nine more. Cool beans. We could actually see about making some of the armor today. I don't know if we're going to be able to, though, because one, two. Yeah, it takes too much draconium. So I'm going to have to fight probably two more ender dragons, and then we'd probably be ready to go. F f did I say ender dragon? Yeah, I was right. I was right. I was right. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't. Worry. Okay. So, um, actually, today, guys, since we got our staff of power, we're gonna take a break from draconium here for a moment. Uh, let me get everything out of my inventory that we don't need. Um, let's see here. I was clearing up some stuff in the back, so that's why everything looks so funky back there. But guys, I actually want to go and scout out a new building location. Um, I've been wanting to put a base just for bees um, since the beginning of time. Um, just kidding, since uh, for a few episodes now. And I think now is a great time to go ahead and see what we want to do. So I'm going to go see about scouting out an area, and I'll be right back. Oh man, guys, I found it. Look at this. It's surrounded by walls. I mean, we, we've got one of those there. But I mean, guys, this is perfect. Now we can test out here. Let's see. Does this mine trees fast? Oh, it does. So this is an everything tool. Oh, yes. So we got this in our... Oh, man. Anyways, but guys, this is exactly what I was thinking about when I did it. Because we could have our bee thing out here in the middle, right? And then we could have, like, an anthill of another base going through the side of the mountain. That's going to look so cool, guys. Oh, man, I'm so excited. This is awesome. So let me go ahead here and terraform a little bit, and we're going to see about making this into a suitable area for the bee stuff. All right, guys, so we've got ourselves a little bit more work to do over here for myself, but as you can see, we've got our little honeycombs going, and then a central meeting point. Uh, hold the phone. Uh, this is off. This is a four. Oh, no. This is supposed to be uh, nine by nine. That's why it took me so long to line these up. 
Um, anyway, they're actually lined up pretty good. I did some clearing out here. Those didn't need any clearing out. This needed some clearing out. So what it looks like is this is just going to be one block wider, these two. Um, but we're going to have, guys, we're going to have basically stages. Um, so obviously the entrance will have to be up here. So we're going to have to terraform this whole area, which won't take very long with this tool. Um, but then we're going to have to make this into kind of an entrance. Um, and then down in the middle here, I want it to be glass. Um, and then we can see our um, linking thing because we're going to link our AE system here. So I'm going to show you guys what we're going to have to set up. We're going to be setting up one of these uh, quantum rings. And that will allow us to link our items over here as, long, as well as our power. So we will also have power and all of our items over here at one point. Because as you can see, if I try to access my ME storage, it's a no-go. We're quite far away from our base. But guys, this is going to look sick. I'm going to do a little bit more work. I just wanted to catch you guys up on that. So I will be right back. All right, look at that, guys. It is looking so much cleaner over here. So much better. I actually haven't looked in here yet. Um, ooh, we got a spellcraft. Oh, and then we got some cool things, I guess. Um... Basically some tree stuff, but this is from Roots 2, so we won't worry about that. Eventually we'll probably knock that down. Uh, but here, guys, we need to make an entrance. And this is how we make an entrance, always. Just like so. And then we'll have um, all of the cool blocks, I guess you could call them. Um, not the cool blocks, but the Magnum Torches. Jeez, <laughs> couldn't think of the name. Uh, but we're going to have a different flooring down here. And we're going to go ahead and do it like this so I can vein miner it. We're going to see if this works. Oh, we got one more. Okay. Now if I go like this. Okay. Did a little more than I wanted. <laughs> oh, man. Um, this dank knoll, guys, is one of the best investments you can make. Um... I love it to death. I actually don't know why it jumped that far, but it looks like it only went out just a little bit. So I'm glad we didn't ruin everything. Um, so that's always a good thing. I uh, I think so anyway. Uh, I'm just checking here, making sure we got all our flooring good. And let's see about using some acacia wood for the flooring in here. And what I'm thinking, guys, we'll do like a layer, um, like a walkway almost around the um each of the hexagons or their wait hold up so each one of these has six sides oh they're octagons oh oh they have eight sides okay so each one of the octagons maybe we go out like three blocks in and we put a path now i will probably change this path um because just looking at it now guys it doesn't actually look all that good with this wood um so let me see here. And I plus I want to have like like the wood sides, but I want to have like a uh a flooring that just knocks it out of the park. I don't know if that makes any any sense at all. But I'm going to go ahead guys and I'm going to keep building on, building on and we're going to see what we get. All right, look at this structure guys. It is coming together. I forgot to do this. That's not the right block. Let's see here. I've actually put these in. I had to put it into my dank null, all the wood, because it was taking up too much of my inventory to do this. Oh, man, there was so much wood, guys. It was like ding, 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 because when you collect the items, it, uh, I guess, uh, sounds like XP hitting your inventory, and it was just constantly tinging me. Um, but here, guys, we're going to put glass here in between all of these. Um, so that is going to be nice and handy dandy. Um, so I think though that is going to wrap up the episode for today. Uh, if you guys did enjoy the episode, please do make sure to hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe. But guys, this has been Super Turtle and this will be working on more next episode. So peace out. Take care. See you next episode. Bye-bye.